Hey YouTube, this is Dean making another vid. If you like my content, please consider hitting the like button. And also, please consider subscribing, as it is very much appreciated. Just got back from the forge. Um, <laughs> I'm absolutely rooted, to tell you the truth. But anyway, um, sorry about swearing. But anyway, yeah, buggered. But um, yeah, had a fantastic day. Um, thanks, Jack, for letting me come over. I was, um, yeah, had a fantastic day. Got a lot done. And um, this is what I made. First attempt at a striker knife. This is also for the weekly blacksmith challenge and my entry into it. Um, I haven't forged anything other than strikers. And I decided that the um, blacksmith challenge, when they said they were going, they wanted a blacksmith's knife to be made so I thought I'd do one my own style um, I wanted to do a striker knife for the blacksmith's knife and this is what I came up with I forged it myself made out a Wiltshire file um, yeah so I'm chuffed about it is an understatement um yeah fantastic if I don't do say so, so say so myself. Yeah, um, turned out really well. I'm really pleased with it. Oil quenched, um, which is a little bit different, but proof is in the pudding. It seems to spark all right. That's going into the on Facebook there's a blacksmith's challenge so that's my entry into it um, it was for a blacksmith's knife leather opener or um, Viking knife and that's the one I did anyway that's a good look around nice thick strike face um, yeah first time I've made anything other than a striker it's still a striker but yeah for a knife I reckon probably hold it like that um, yeah I'm going to sharpen it a little bit more it is reasonably sharp but um, didn't really bring anything out to cut it with it's just um, sharpened on the belt on the belt sander but um, I'm going to sharpen it up properly, but yeah, it, um, I'm going to sharpen it properly up, get it nice and sharp. But with this, with the striker knives, usually are dangerous to use somewhat because the spine, you can't hold on to them very well. But I made it big enough so that you can stay well away and strike here or there, as you saw. You've got no chance of going up onto the up onto the um, onto the edge. So yeah. Anyway, that's I got that. My antler build. Put the stroke plate in. Got the stroke plate hardened. Um, quenched it. Wheelchair file, um, sparks really well. Um, yeah, fits really well. These come up really well. Put my O in it. I, 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 yeah, I, sh I stamped my O on that one. And one of the other wheelchair files, triangular files. This one was, I made Dexter his little one. I made this one a little bit bigger so that um and yeah it it probably should have been i should have stayed with the smaller one it turned i got the curls really well done like that it's probably the best one i've done so far sparks really well as you can see Starting to blunt out there now, but um, yeah, um, it sparks really well, but uh, yeah, 
the curls probably could have been a bit, if the striker had been a bit smaller and the curls could have been a little bit closer together, probably would have been a little bit easier to use. Um, yeah, I just, I made it so that it fits my hand a bit better. But, um, yeah, I probably should have made it a bit smaller. But it's still a really nice striker. Um, yeah, I really like it. Um, yeah, it sparks really well on a sharp edge. But yeah, I'm, I'm really chuffed with this. This one is, this one turned out really well. It's fantastic, if I do say so myself. I'm really happy with it. Just, um, it fits my hand. It's, it's a big knife, but that's, um, I, I like a big knife and I've got big hands. So yeah, but anyway, that's, I haven't, I haven't made embers with any of these, so I should make an ember with at least one of them. But I am, um, yeah, just really worn out, I'm very tired. I might have to nap this edge, it's starting to get a little bit. <sighs> Trying to get a one strike catch, but anyway, it didn't. Always try to and that edge is getting very worn. That one did. Should try it on that sharper edge. did a proper strike it'd probably work better anyway proof in the pudding all three of them are all tested anyway they all spark well this is the first time i've ever oil quenched and got them to spark so um yeah i normally water quench but we were a bit worried about cracks because of the um thinner thinner edge there um when we were doing um the the edge grinds and then yeah, we we're just worried about cracking, so that's why we oil quenched it. And um, yeah, it worked out really well, so that was great. Anyway, I'm getting ash all over me, burning myself, so I will sign off because that is blowing a gale all over me. There we go. That stopped that business happening. Anyway. As I said, it's carrying on like pork chop. It's all over the place. Sorry about that. That's what I got done at the forge. Um, yeah, again, I just wanted to thank Jack for letting me come over. Um, yeah, just had a fantastic day. I'll post this up on Facebook and um, I'll do another video, just a, a short video of this spark testing because I wanna show this spark testing as well. I don't want to do this video for the spark test of it on it. Anyway, thanks for watching.